Greetings, YouTube, and welcome to another epic Rift Gamble, brought to you by your friend Prof Huff. And hopefully not the third time we've gambled and gotten six stones, though I've put ten sigs into Warlock, so like, taking a step back, I'm happy with that, you know? Like, they've both been tech, both been plus five, plus one, six stones. But as a reminder, this is so worth it. If you have a five-star champion that really needs to be awakened, you can use this basically as a generic awakening gem as long as you wait until the class of your choice is there. But because I have a five-star generic awakening gem I've been hoarding since Kabam Santa gave it to us in December, I'm not going to need it. Which is why I'm set to do my seventh, I guess, tier four epic riff. Now, even though we have heard that Kabam support to their credit has helped reward some people with their intel back if they've accidentally jumped into a quest with their two-star champs. Kabam support doesn't always treat everybody the same way when you file a help ticket. So you don't want to be that person that doesn't get it approved. So when you go to the Epic Rift, it's really important that you change out those two stars. What I have started becoming in the habit of doing I'm on a live stream, I go into a regular event quest, I switch out the two stars, four, my five, and my six stars, or whatever my best champions are that I'm going to take in, before I even buy the intel purchase. Just so I know there's no chance that I'm going to accidentally put my two stars in. We're also going to say shout out to the student today, Steve Wester, and people like to have more of the game, so we're going to leave Steve not on screen, but he gets the shout out. Also remember y'all, Red Hulk is the target for today. Okay, here we go. No time like the present to jump into another Epic Rift. So. What do you think we will get if you're watching this live? Do you think we'll get cursed more six stones? Will this be the awakening gem day? We have, uh, on one occasion, gotten the 10,000 five star shards. That would always be ideal. And uh oh, Stroke of My Saber says Mama Bear won't say hi to him. I'm sure, I'm sure she will. All right, let's see. Who are the six stones for today? They're always tech for me. All right, we got the regular 1,000 five-star shards. <laughs> this is my third day of Tech Six Stones. Please do not have that be a sign from the Kabam gods. And then we have ourselves the usual Tier 5 basic, the five-star shards, the six-star shards. I would love another 1,000 six-star shards if Kabam wants to be nice. Let's go all the way down. We have another science wing. So the this is the exact same setup that I had two days ago. I had a science five star awakening gym and I had tech six stones. It's like Groundhog Day for my account. So let's um, hopefully not get the six stones. We're gonna count to four and chance it. One, two, three. No, don't go top left, don't go top left, don't go, and it did and It's like, it's like, it's like, why even chance it? You know it's, it's rigged. It's like the exact same rift. Two days in a row. And a bunch of people, of course, are saying, ha ha, we told you so. What's up, Steve Nardar99? Shout out to the student of the day. Thank you for the computer fun. Um, yep, a bunch of you called it. Dang it! There's just a lot of people laughing now. I know those of you watching this after I've clipped the clip can't see how many people are laughing at my pain. I mean, again, Warlock gets five more sigs. That is not the worst thing to happen on my account. But maybe last time, not only did we get the six stones, but we did not get a platinum pool sighting, which was very disappointing. So let's hope that that changes at least can we at least see our our boy platinum pool that's my hope so i get the dark cock or guillotine 2099 would be better but 
my Warlock is the only one of those champions that's at rank 5. So I just, you know, kind of like to add a little bit to his PI. And uh, it's just a personal preference. So, I am Sig Stone Cursed. I knew that I was being too optimistic to want anything else. But, there you go. And uh, here we go. We're barking that chicken while we cross over into the Sig Stone Lane. Yay! <laughs> oh, what a life. Now, will we see Platinum Pool on this rift? I'm hoping today's the day that we get two-star Doctor Doom and we win the video game with a two-star Doom. Or a two-star Ghost. That would be... That'd be okay. So... We've just got... A little more... To go. And, uh... I'm saving my domino. I haven't got tier two alpha. Oh, no platinum. This is literally the same exact rift. I don't even know if I care if I die at this point. That got very dark. But I guess I should care enough. We're going to do a medium. Followed by a heavy. She hasn't become unlucky yet, unfortunately. And she's down. Thank you, perfect RNG, literally. All right, well, we have uh, almost enough time for the prayers of the two stars to end this. So thank you to everybody who came by to watch this Rift live. It was Rift number seven. And um, we are riffing for better luck. I've seen some people get like three or four five-star awakening gems so far. It's crazy. But that is just not the case with me. All right, come on. Two-star Doctor Doom. Let's let today be the day. <laughs> well, it's a, it's a new two-star. It's Man-Thing. Assuming that man has a thing. My life is complete. I got a two-star Man-Thing. And maybe we'll get Warlock or somebody else here. Come on, luck. I love these two stars. They're my favorite thing. Oh! Can you say Red Hulk and Emma as two new two stars? That is so very exciting. Well, that's going to conclude this epic rift run. Thanks again to Steve for being the student of the day. And I hope that all of you have better luck than I did today. Back-to-back -to -back rifts of five-star trash it happens have a good one youtube